what's up welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Bailey and in today's video I am just taking you guys along for a weekend in my life so Matt is here with me now say hello you're with it's me so bright I'm, I'm not the one driver whatever it's so bright and I tried to turn it down but I don't know let me see just the sun it looks it looks better right here uh my battery's gonna die look at that all right guys yeah i forgot to charge my camera battery so i'm gonna be vlogging the rest of this vlog until we get home um on my phone so if the quality changes so sorry about that but yes i'm just gonna do a little bit of a weekend of my life we're headed to charlotte now to run some errands and yeah if you're new here make sure to give this video a thumbs up as well as hit that subscribe button down below and i will catch up with you guys probably once we get to charlotte on my phone all right, so we just got to South Park and we put our name down at the Cheesecake Factory and now we're going in the mall. And they have like, look. Oh, I thought that was a Peter pin. <laughs> yeah, these are them. They are the Pacebreaker Short 7 inch. 
So this was their best seller. They said for men's shorts, they're really soft. Do you think they're soft? Do you like them? Okay. You can try them on when we get home and tell what you think. So I got those for him. And then I had these one pair of little lemon shorts that I'm not a huge fan of because they're more of, it's probably about to fall. They're more of a spandexy material, honestly. And they just, oh, this lighting is terrible right now. They're just, um, very, now. You fucking slow down. Well, don't cuss in the vlog. We could never live in Charlotte because he cannot handle the traffic. Or the people <laughs> at all. But anyway, um, my pair of little lemon shorts I don't just love, so I got a different pair than I normally get. I got the Hotty Totty or Hotty Totty, the Hotty Hot LR short, four inch line. I got four inch because they have the uh, two and a half inch, but I'm a little bit more, I don't know, I just like a little bit more length than that because I have the two and a half inch of the other ones, and I don't know, I just think I'm a little bit past where super super of my butt shorts terrible lighting but i got this color it's like a white blue almost in these so hopefully i'll like this option better than the other ones i have because they're definitely not my favorite so that is what i got at south park and now we're headed back home and now the lighting's better um and so once we get home i'll show you the dogs and vlog some of them I'm going live with our families on our wait list um tonight at 7 30 on our private facebook group so i'm doing that so yeah we had a good time cheesecake was really good and then if i eat my leftover salad for dinner um just got home gonna let the dogs out and then look what i came home to <laughs> honey come here oh my goodness she got out of her pen Miss Nimmin, sister. So Miss Nimmin here escaped the whelping box and was out of her whelping box and was so scared. Mm, sweet girl. Okay, let's put you back. Go back in. Here's Jagger playing some frisbee since we were gone all day. Can I have it? Let go. Let go. Let go. Ready? Uh, uh, no, ma'am. Sit, Harlow. Sit. Sit down. Good job. Go get it. They love to play fetch. It's like their favorite game. Good job. Good, bring it back. All right, guys. So, like you saw, we are home now. I am finally back on my camera. I let it charge for a little bit, so we're good to go there. Um, but I am going to take some time now to clean out slash clean up my closet. There's a ton on the floor. It looks a hot mess. I've got way too many clothes and a lot of it I just genuinely do not wear. So I'm going to clean it out. So I thought I would vlog a little bit and do a little bit of a time lapse of me cleaning it up. Cleaning it up, cleaning it out. Um, I was going to wear this today, but I didn't. So I'm just going to clean it out and try to see like what I just need to donate and what I can try to sell so that is what I'm going to do now and thought you guys would enjoy a little cleaning type montage I with you in sunset lights I just need time at a poolside Yeah, white wine on the moonlight Yeah, I got a whole lot of affection Got it, got it And I got a question How you defy all logic? Are you alien, angel, guys?
washed, feeding the dogs. Huggers. Hi, me eating. And he's over there. And now I am about to hop on my computer and do some work before my live with the puppy families at 7.30. So, I'm about to do that. I need to get a few things together for something I'm doing tomorrow. I'll probably talk more about it in tomorrow's part of this vlog, but I also need to edit a video to get to a brand for approval by Monday. So I kind of have both those things I have to get done. So editing a video for Monday and then also preparing for this thing that I'm doing tomorrow, which I will talk to you guys more about tomorrow. So while they eat, I'm going to get my own salad from earlier and eat that and also do some work. Sunday. We just got back from church. My hair really is sticking straight out. We were in a rush this morning. I was a little bit late, so just threw it up in a ponytail, so it definitely doesn't look the best, but we just got home from church, and we are about to take some pictures of the puppies for their three-week-old pictures, and then we are going to head to Statesville to pick up some stuff and get some lunch as well, and then tonight I've got something that I will talk to you guys about here in a little bit. Yeah, just want to say hello, happy Sunday, and I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. Okay guys, I cleaned out the puppy's pen. Indy fed them. You can see she's going in there to see what's up. Alright, go on. So everyone's up, so I'm going to go ahead and add this in today as our first whooping box novelty item. So, oh. Well, I'm gonna have to open it up, so give me just a second. <laughs> so I'm going to just add all these different little texture pieces throughout their box and see what they think of them. And it, uh, hello. And then you've got Sissy Duda who wants to eat them. Alrighty, so puppies are experiencing their first whelping box novelty item right now. As you can see some of them are just playing. Some of them, like Miss Strawberry, are investigating. And Mr. Apple is trying to climb out of the whelping box like he always does. Look at Miss Strawberry exploring. She is a great little girl. Oh, look at Blueberry. Oh, Miss Grapes getting one. Look, Mr. Blueberry. Oh, look at them. Oh, Kiwi. Oh, look at Banana. Look, go over there. Oh, look at him. Alright guys, we just got done taking puppy pictures. I'm 
putting them up. Matt was helping me, but look at these three little girls. <laughs> look at how cute. Look at little Nimmin. <laughs> oh, so sweet. I'll enter the pictures in here right now. Guys, I have not hardly vlogged at all today because <laughs> because I was gone to an event from four to seven and I just got back home and it was something that I told you guys earlier in the vlog that I would kind of talk to you guys a little bit more about. So last November, I had a girl reach out about me coordinating her wedding. So I have started doing a little bit of that on the side. So I started by just doing her wedding with her. Obviously it's not happened yet, it's happening in November. Um, but last November she reached out and just a friend of mine had recommended me to her because I guess she just thought I'd done such a good job with my wedding and that I would have the good personality for that. And I kind of have always wanted to coordinate weddings on the side and do something like that. I just never really, I guess, took the leap of faith. And Jagger, your head, lay down. <laughs> I just never took the leap of faith to do it myself. And then recently, I had another bride reach out about me coordinating her wedding and mind you this is like no advertising no talking about it publicly on my social nothing like that like literally just i don't even know how she found out that i was doing it i think i might have commented on a friend of a friend's post like you should have me coordinate it haha ha, like just joking um and i guess she saw that i don't really know how but anywho so i booked her wedding for january so i now have two weddings booked down I'm being so distracting. So I now have two weddings booked um, of my very own. I'm going to be helping a fellow coordinator that's local to this area um, as well with a few weddings just to kind of get to my feet wet before running these weddings all by myself. So yeah, I went today to what's called a summer social. So it was a venue local to here that was holding a like get together with a bunch of different vendors to um and then invited a bunch of brides and their families to come and check out the different vendors and the venue and stuff and i was the event coordinator vendor so i was there today talking with brides booking new brides um i'm pretty sure i booked probably at least three more weddings um from today i wasn't ready to take a deposit there but they were very interested so i think i've booked a few more so that's really exciting but i think i'm going to go ahead and just kind of talk about it now on social and you know announce instagram and all that stuff so i'm just calling it bailey williams events and design because we are going to hopefully start doing some more different things in the future as well so not just wedding coordinating so i just called it bailey williams events and design and yeah i'll link the instagram down below the instagram is bw events and design just because bailey williams events and design is literally super long so harlow is chewing on her bowl back here as well so ignore that if you can hear that but yeah that's what i was doing today just chatting with other vendors and other brides and stuff like that and just kind of getting my name and this new little business underway um so yeah that is what i was doing that's what i was doing earlier i was getting some business cards printed out and another like little flyer for that event as well printed out so yeah that's kind of the newest little thing that i'm doing i've been doing it now for like i said since last november with this one bride and i'm just deciding now to kind of take it more public and kind of advertise it a little bit more and kind of see where it takes me um but yeah i always knew this was something i wanted to get into just didn't really know how and then it kind of came to me i guess you could say so yeah that's what i was doing today and now i am about to do some editing as well as do some work for rosary doodles so i am going to hop off here and do some of that and then i will pop back on to end this vlog a little bit later all right guys i am showered and clean and now just came to say good night to the puppies and i'm about to change out their pee pads for some fresh ones and get them tucked in bed and ready for the night they had a big day today they had pictures they had their first whooping box novelty item so they had a big day but i just want to show you guys real quick them before I end the vlog as well because I know you guys love seeing the puppies even though this vlog wasn't super focused on them so here they are sweet babies all right guys I went ahead and turned on some traffic 
type music for the puppies so they can get used to the sound, things like that. Um, so that is part of our curriculum. We do noise exposure. So this is our noise exposure for today. All right, guys, the noise is on. Got the pee pads changed. She just actually used it right there. So I tape them down with blue painter's tape so they don't like chew on the edges or do anything like that. So puppies are good for the night. This is what Indy's mom duties look like. Bunch of thirsty babies. Okay guys, I realized that I never came on here and properly ended this vlog and I'm about to edit it. So I just want to say thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up as well as hit that subscribe button down below. I have a ton of fun golden doodle content coming your guys' way in the next few days. So get excited for that. Thank you so much again for watching and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.